We have Help Me Hank here live in our studio, and he's testing out Timu. If you haven't heard of it, it's a wildly popular shopping website offering many popular items at very bargain prices, like this $4 jumper for a child. Which, do we like this? Well, let's what talk we to think? Hank about it. Hank will know. Red flags. <laughs> uh, Hank is here, and we twisted his arm uh, to find out all these good bars. We had to make you shop for this story. I know. This is a really tough assignment, right? <laughs> <laughs> so, I mean, this gym bag, one of the items that we bought, but it's filled with so many different things that we purchased. I mean, we've got shoes in here. We've got a portable blender, phone chargers. The question that we wanted answered, are these really great deals, or are you just buying a lot of junk? Take a look. Timu, have you heard of the website? The prices are so low. I mean, it seems like almost everything you look at on this website is under $15. If you're not, you may not be a real bargain shopper because this website appears to offer unbelievable deals. A massage gun for $33, other brands well over $100. Earbuds under $10, some brands more than $150. Clothes, shoes, and bags, most of the items between $10 and $30. I know the products were inexpensive, but are they cheap? Is the quality cheap? I put the word out on Instagram. Hey friends, have you tried Timu? Well, Sarah says, bought six items total, all but two were total junk. Kara tells me, I bought a cat toy, iPhone charger, and toilet bowl cleaner. I avoided the clothing. Denise says, it's great, cheap, and the website is easy to navigate. It is a totally legitimate website where whatever you buy, you're going to get, but buyer beware, cheap prices typically translate into cheaply made goods. Andrea Warrock is a money saving expert. She's bought items on Timu herself and knows those low prices, well, they can be appealing. They actually connect sellers directly with buyers, so they're cutting out the middleman. But I wanted to see what all the hype was about, so I did a little shopping on my own iPhone fast charger. Our budget around $100. And for that, we got all of these items. A gym bag for about 20 bucks. Gym shoes, 18. Casual slip on loafers, about $23. A manicure set, expandable garden hose, wireless charger for four bucks. A mini hidden camera, an iPhone charger, again for four. A girl's romper dress, five bucks. That massage gun massager, a car vacuum earbuds, and a portable blender. Here is what I notice. Let's talk about the clothing and the shoes. These loafers, they're okay, but take a look. They are very cheaply made. These tennis shoes, they're probably all right to kick around. The gym bag, it was only 20 bucks, but it feels very cheap, and it's also a lot smaller than I thought. And this dress for my daughter, an absolute no-go. It just doesn't even feel comfortable. All right, let's talk about the electronics we bought. Now, the phone charger we got for around $4, it's working. The phone's taking a charge. Same thing with this fast charger. The earbuds we got for about 10 bucks, they also work. But what I keep hearing about from people online is that they work now, but they may not work in about a month. And so you really want to evaluate the purchase to decide, is this something I should spend more on to get longevity and save? at the end of the day. Timu offers prices on most items that are roughly 30 to 70% more affordable than you'll find on competitor websites. So how do they do it? Well, the products, they're off brand. For example, the earbuds, they may not be Apple or Sony. It's likely a manufacturer you've never heard of overseas. Which brings me to the next issue, shipping. It can take 10 to 30 days to receive all the items, but if that's not a problem, who cares? All right, so you've been touching and feeling some of these things. Yes, my observation of the jumper for your daughter. Yes. Um, the material feels like the material that you get like when you're going to get a Halloween costume. <laughs> yes. It's something temporary. So Correct. like the person you interviewed there, she said, you know, if you're looking for something for more longevity, probably not the place. Yeah. But if it's a one and done, you want a cute little summer thing for a there little backyard party. Right. But I'll, the, it definitely, I'll give that to Rosie, that's fine. It definitely <laughs> feels like it same would fall thing with apart the, Same thing with the shoes. Those I mean, look 
great. They look great. They are not comfortable. It oh. feels like you're walking, you know, with cardboard, which you really are. I mean, look at it right so there. So those are more like oh. sitting shoes, which these, Ashley and I know all about. These are, <laughs> yes, these are the male equivalent of a good sitting okay. shoe, if you will. And the same things with the chargers. I mean, they work, but again, as Jason was just mentioning as we were watching the story, you have to be careful because a lot of these off-brand chargers could not only be a fire hazard, mm. they could also screw yeah. up your device. Right. That's true, too. And only and this, work for about 30 days. 30 days, that's it. What do you yeah. want? I'll give you three bucks for this. What is it? It's a blender. It's a, I'm upselling it, Cole Thorpe. It's five dollars now. <laughs> after the comment, after the comment. Yeah. Yeah. And then the thing is, they're so inexpensive, you would never return it. No. Like, that would be a pain to try and return it. Right, it would it. be yeah. more You're gas money to it. drive oh. to Costco to return it or Whole Foods <laughs> right. or wherever you have to go. Many of us but have yeah, learned if you're, the hard way. if you're looking for a quick, cheap, item. Yeah. It's great, but don't think that you're going to keep this these clothes for 5 years. Right. That's not or what it's that about. Or that bag is going to Or hold this up. bag. No. Uh-uh. Okay.